This your boy Papa Pimp. Just letting y'all know I'm going live Thursday, 8 p.m. And before I get into this, shout out to all the people that donated to my channel. I couldn't do it without y'all. But make sure you come to my live Thursday, 8 p.m. Men, women, everywhere. Share, subscribe. Let everybody know my lives are what it is. Thursday, 8 p.m. Be there. It's your boy Papa Pimp with another breakdown of a video I did in Raleigh, North Carolina. And in this video, I had on jewelry. So, you know what I'm saying? If you watched this video, you knew I tried a different tactic. I wanted to see how women was going to react to me with jewelry compared to not having jewelry. So, let's get into this breakdown. Let's get into this video. Excuse me. I want to say you're a very beautiful lady. What's your name? Thank you. My name's Corey. I'm doing out here from nice Florida, so I thought I'd introduce myself. You got some soft hands. Thank you. Yeah, you, know, you a rich and friendly? No, I'm not. I'm just here for a day trip. Now, you seen how um, friendly she was, though, when I came up to her. I don't know if it was the jury or I don't know if it was just, you know, me being myself, though. Pretty much it looks like... It was the same thing I always do, you know what I'm saying? She was really friendly when I came up to her. She from Charlotte. You know, she let me hold her hands and, you know, see how soft they was. Mm -hmm. So she was pretty much somebody that was cool to get to know. So, you know what I'm saying? All you got to do when you go up to these women, have confidence. If you want to add a little jewelry, add a little something to make you stand out a little more, do what you do, though. You know what I'm saying? Because most of the time, the woman ain't going to question this shit. Oh, okay. Where are you from? Um, well, I'm originally from Georgia, but I drove up here from Charlotte. Oh, okay. Well, maybe I can get to know you a little bit, though. You know I what I'm saying? Here well, I live in Greensboro. I ain't too far from Charlotte. Greensboro? Yeah, it's like an hour away. Because I had to pass that to get here. Yeah, right? yeah. I'm from there. I live there now. I've been up in Greensboro like a month now. A month? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really? Yeah, yeah. Like it? I mean, it's different. It's different from Florida, but of course, huh? I was in Miami, Florida, so. Oh yeah, you went to Disney and you didn't slow it all the way down. Came to the well, country. I started my own business. I do um, electrical, <laughs> and um, my nephew go to college out there. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I can get your number so we can talk sometimes. Yeah. And like I said, I'm the champ. So you know what I'm saying? You seen how she was willing to give me the number? Want no hard? Want nothing tough about that one? She was feeling me from the jump. You know what I'm saying? So it was like. Ain't too much I can say about that actual pickup is that have confidence is all I can say about that. Yeah, yeah, sure. You pretty free though? Mm -hmm. You pretty free, got pretty free scuffy? I wouldn't say I would. I would say I'm a sexy, busy person and I came up here to take a breather. It uh, wasn't much, yeah, but yeah. I decided to get out by myself, kids at the house and blah, 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 but yeah. Okay, what's your number? It's 92, right? Nice. Okay, I'm gonna call you now. And yeah, maybe we can set up a date that you like to travel, I like to travel, okay. so we can get there, you know, we can meet up halfway, or I come to your city, come to my city. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Alright, gotcha. Yeah, yeah. Thank you so much for yeah, coming yeah. back. Yeah, yeah, nice to meet you, though. Nice to meet you, too. I hope All you enjoy right. your trip and you stay. Alright, you too. All right. <laughs> Now, that was pretty simple, though, you know what I'm saying? I ain't had no struggle getting on her. When I came into um the store, I forgot what store it was, um, I just immediately seen her, and I was like, man, I'm going to get on her, you know what I'm saying? She had a nice body. I wish I could have got more of her body, because she definitely had a very, very nice body. Her looks was okay. Plus, she was very friendly. So when I approached her, rejection or if I would have got her, it was really easy to talk to her. And she was very open to getting to know me, you know what I'm saying? So in those type of situations, you know what I'm saying, you always have an upper hand if this woman is open and she's willing to get to know you. But let's get into the next one. Excuse me. Excuse me. I just want to tell you, um, thank you. You are so beautiful. What's your name, you know? Well, my name is Corey. I'm new out here from Florida, so I thought I'd introduce myself. I've seen a beautiful lady, but I don't think I can come over and ask you out sometimes. You can know you a little bit. Now, she going to hit me with the no. I will say she was like nice. I thought she was a nice looking woman. She also had a nice body, too. She was nice, but at the same time, she told me no. So, you know, she wanted to end it a little short. So, I mean, you know what I'm saying? Don't get mad at her because she rejected you. Just take it as it is. I use a little simple pickup line. And in the mall, I think the mall is a little bit more challenging. Now, same thing. I still got the chains on. So I don't think the chains matter when it came to this lady. She didn't even care. She probably seen it. She probably didn't care about that. So she might actually got a man. What do you think of? Sometimes you can't argue with when something's in all caps. Oh, okay. I didn't know you had a girlfriend. Okay. You can't have friends, though? No, not really. Okay, well, you have a good one. 
Now, she said she can't have friends, though. So, we don't know what's up with this woman. She could be lying. She could be telling the truth. I mean, I use it as um, a build-up in confidence, you know what I'm saying? Even though my confidence is super high, I just use this to, like, keep me at a point like, okay, okay, these women going to say no sometimes. These women going to say yes sometimes, so just move on. When you're approaching these women, you're talking to these women, learn how to actually <clears throat> get them when they're moving, too. You know what I'm saying? I prefer to try to get on women when they ain't moving, but you can also practice on them when they moving, like in places like the mall, because in the mall, you hardly ever gonna see a woman being still because they, it's just a place where you move unless you go inside of the stores. Excuse me, I just wanna thank you. For being so beautiful. Oh, thank you. Okay. Okay. Now you see how friendly she was though. I came up from behind, I had to chase her down. And she had a nice body too. And I told her, you know, use that pickup line, I just want to tell you thank you. And she like, for what? You know what I'm saying? For you being so beautiful. I mean, that's simple stuff mm -hmm. that can get women's attention, get them to just speak to you, get them to talk to you. And sometimes you're not gonna get the best reactions from women, but if the women are cool, they're gonna have good reactions. Yeah. What's your name? I'm out here for my own so I thought I introduced myself. I'm not What's your name, Corey? What is it? Corey. Corey. You know. Some fans, bro. Oh, well, Maybe I can get to know you a little bit and take you out sometime. Okay. Well, what are you up here, visiting? I know. I look at you now. I look at you now. So you want me to get lucky? You got a pretty free schedule? Huh? You got a pretty free schedule? Pretty much. Okay. I'm down here visiting. I'm visiting my best day. So how often do you be down here? Huh? How often do you be down here? A lot. Okay, well, what's your number? What's your number? Uh, it's 419 area. Huh? Now, I'm going to skip this part right here because I didn't want to see the meme. Me. Uh, oh, Ohio. Okay, okay. Yeah, you just go, you from Ohio. Where the hell you just come from? Oh, I was over there sitting in my home, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, so that's why when you said that, you know, I'm like, what, that, what did that mean? Nah, nah, I don't know if you were did you call me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, maybe we can um, get up sometimes, though, you know what I'm saying? I hit you up right away. You didn't go through, so I was going to say text me. Hey, text you? Okay. Uh, let me see. Uh, yeah, I'm going to go through. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you see what they're doing back right here? Uh, I'll text you now. Yeah, let me know. Dun, 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 Wolite protects your favorites from fading, pilling, Stop. and stretching. Wolite, protect what you love. Let me know if you got it. I told you now. Okay. Uh, nice well, well, nice meeting you. Nice <laughs> now, she was pretty cool, though. You know what I'm saying? Wasn't nothing hard about it. She visited the city and stuff like that. She do from Ohio. She come out a lot. So, pretty simple. Pretty easy to pick up. You know what I'm saying? I know I heard some dudes saying, I don't holler at white women. She was not white. She was a mixed chick. Or she was just really light skinned. So, I mean, if you black, I'm going to holler at you. I don't really mess with white women. But light skinned women, I can get them. Or I can holler at dark skinned or brown skinned. It really don't matter to me. You know what I'm saying? I even had a guy who was saying that he'd never seen no light skinned cup in his life. You know, he was kind of a weirdo. But see how simple and easy this pickup was? I broke it down. I got on the woman. I just um, talk, had conversation with her. You know what I'm saying? I put that pickup line out there. She asked me a few questions. Boom, and I got her. So let's get to the next one. Uh, excuse me. I want to tell you thank you. Huh? I want to tell you thank you. For what? For you being beautiful. Oh, What's your name? You. My name is Corey. I'm here from Florida. Oh, I'm, my name is Marie. Oh, nice to meet you. I was thinking I might ask you. I'll take you out sometime. Okay. Are you lying? No. Oh, you mad? Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm sorry about that. Yeah, yeah. I know your husband like you, man. Yeah. Yeah. Nice to meet you, though. Nice yeah. Me too. That was just one of them situations where I ran into a friendly person, you know what I'm saying? The pickup line, get them started with the conversation. She was friendly. And at the mall, it's a little bit challenging. I challenge some of y'all guys to go to the mall and try to pick up women too. Because some people might have a better chance in the mall than they do going to places like Walmart, Target. And the mall is more of a social place. But at the same time, it's just like going to these um stores too, or a grocery store, because... People going to the mall sometimes to chill and have fun, and most time they with the family. Some people going to the mall to um actually, you know, just buy stuff. So 
you know what I'm saying? It's like a little bit harder, I think, because people are moving. But the change might have helped me out, or, or maybe I was really aggressive, you know what I'm saying? But let me know what y'all think about this breakdown. Let me know what y'all think about this video of me in Raleigh, North Carolina. And tell me some other places y'all would th like me to go. You know what I'm saying? Um, if you need some one-on-ones, um, this is... If you need some one-on-ones and somebody to coach you with the game and getting women, I do one-on-ones. And you can email me on, on papapimp884 at gmail.com. Again, that is papapimp884 at gmail.com. We can talk, discuss, do some one-on-ones. You know what I'm saying? We can FaceTime talk and you know, talk about the game a little bit. And also, man, in the comment section, give me some ideas, some um, pickup lines you would like me to use, um, some tips. Anything or some topics y'all would like me to do for my live show, just hit me up, man. This your boy Papa Pimp. Y'all have a good one.